And we're back, and this time I'm going to show you how to create a 3D pie chart in Adobe Illustrator. So we'll start creating a regular pie chart with the chart tool. With this pie graph tool, I drag it on the canvas and I type in some random parameters. Let's use social media platforms and give them a random percentage value. Let's say 30, 25. 25 and 20. So this gives us this basic pie chart. Make sure it's selected. And now we'll go to object and flatten the transparency. And now we can ungroup it on the object. Let me put that to the side. You can see we don't have just these four pieces of pie. We've also got kind of like an outline for them. I want to get rid of the outline. We don't need that in our 3D pie chart. And now I'll use a shift click to give the squares in the legend and the pie the same color. All right, the final one, let's make it blue. So now you can rotate it. The position is important for the final design. So I like to put the smallest one somewhat in the forefront and the biggest one either on the left in the background or the right. And now I select them each. Go to effect, then 3D and extrude and bevel. We use 6000 for the angle and for the extrude depth I'll just use the values of the percentages and add a zero to it so 300 for 30 percent here for our YouTube pie piece and the other ones Facebook and Twitter get 250 the angle is the same so keep that 6000 and the final one it only gets a 200 for the extrude depth. All right, that's what we want. Now we can select them all and go to object and expand the appearance. And now we can select them all control and then connect the anchor points. Obviously you can see we need to play around with the arrangement. So on the right click arrange and then center back or center front, you can put them in the right order. So what we need to connect first are the ones in the background. So let me select the two in the forefront. Then I select the orange one, hold control and position it to the center. I'll reposition the two in the front. And I need to bring the green one to the front, so right click arrange, bring to front. And now the blue one needs to get in the front once more. And that's basically it. This is how you can create these pie charts. As I said, you can see if the small one was in the background, it wouldn't look that good, so you always want to rotate it so that the big ones are, are behind uh, the small ones. If you want to add a number to it, just use the type tool and then maybe you want to add an effect to that as well. Let me try out different values. I'll use the same 3D extrude bevel effect for the type. Let me use 50, 30 and minus 15. And the extrude def should be way smaller. Let me make that white. And I guess that's fine for this example. I'll just size it up. I'll hold shift and all when I do so. Now I'll hold alt and I drag three copies out of it. And then I press T to change the values to 25, 25 and 20.
And that's it. This is how you can create this 3D pie chart in Adobe Illustrator. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.